Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. Today's episode we're going to be taking a look at the shooting fish on a scooter challenge. For this we're going to need a sniper rifle. If you have a silenced one, bring that along because it'll make things a hell of a lot easier. The first thing we need to do is get ourselves the scuba diver instructor's disguise. What I've decided to do for this is to use some emetic poison on him so we can isolate him and just get his disguise nice and easily. I'm sure we can create distractions into the brushes, but there's just so many people around and there's heads looking in all sorts of directions. If you head into this like bushy area, you can use your instinct and there is actually a plant that you can grab and that will work as emetic poison. There's actually a couple of these plants in the Columbia level as well. They're quite handy. If you head over to the dinghy with the skis in front of it, there is a oxygen tank. Now if you crouch when you insert the poison, you actually do it from a crouched position and it stops people from seeing you. It's so... it just it acts as though you are crouched when you do it. So that's a nice little trick to use kind of anywhere. If you want to lockpick a door or grab something off a bench, you can do it from the crouch position. So if we just wait here, the scuba instructor will eventually use that scuba tank and he will get sick and head towards the bathroom. So what we're going to do is we're going to skip that till he's on his way. As you can see, the instructor is using the snorkel now and he is going to feel pretty shitty after that. No pun intended actually definitely intended so he's now going to go and find a bathroom now fortunately there's one really close and really really alone so we can isolate him nice and easy it's on the to the right of us there is just a villa and he's just going to head to that bathroom so we'll head there now We need to drop our briefcase on those stairs because we can't climb with it. But also, if we leave it too high, people will see it and they take it. It's so annoying. So make sure that you drop your briefcase like somewhere that it's not going to be spotted. And you can't actually drop it in the water, otherwise you lose it as well. So he's just about to head into the bathroom. Once he's in and the door's closed, you can just walk up to him and choke him out. Now we'll pop him in the crate and we'll pop on his disguise. If it's the first time you're putting on his disguise, you'll get the Rapture of the Deep challenge. But we've used this before, so we won't get it. Pick up the key. And now we need to pick up our sniper rifle and then go and find Steven. Now he's over by the gym area. He's either running in the gym or between the gym and the little secret, well not secret, but the little private island. So if we just head towards the gym, you can use your instinct and he's pretty easy to find. For me, he was he was just right here. So you need to run up to him and interact with him. Mr. Bradley, are these yours? Dude, Give him the keys. And now we need to head to his jet ski. Now there is a... My pleasure. Uh, like a, I don't even know what, you can drop your gun, if you drop your gun there, sometimes it works, sometimes it doesn't, you can create a distraction for his bodyguard, and what it'll do, his bodyguard will pick up that gun and walk off, and then you can just, you're just safe to, safe to go, but again, this lady can be super annoying, because she walks from here, back to the, back to the resort, and then back to the spot, and if she sees you with a sniper rifle, then you're, you're done for. So we'll just take her out, and we'll just hide her in the shrubs here, because that's where she belongs, in the shrubs. Pull out your sniper rifle. I can't find mine. There it is. So we'll pull out our sniper rifle, and now we just need to wait here. Unfortunately, that gun that I dropped didn't make our bodyguard leave but that's okay we don't really need to worry about that so Steven's gonna get on the jet ski we need to wait for it to actually be moving and then shoot him while he's on it 
Now I am a terrible, terrible sniper, so I'm gonna make a save because I I don't know how many times I don't want to tell you how many times I attempted this before I got it. It was it was more than five, I'll tell you that. So as soon as he takes off, he's fair game. And now all you need to do is just shoot him. He does a few loops. Two targets remaining. But once you hit him, that's it. So, Challenge that's complete. Bradley taken care of. So guys, well like always, thank you so much for coming to hang out with me today. I really appreciate it. If you're new here, make sure you subscribe so you don't miss out on any of the other challenges as we make our way through the Hitman trilogy. And we'll catch you next time. Ciao.